All right, do we have... Who's doing that? Who's the All right, so uh, we're going to play a game we haven't played. Does somebody have... Heather, will you please go get the bucket? Uh, when you guys came in here, we might have asked you to fill out like a favorite movie quote. And we're going to play a game called Blind Line. And what's going to happen is the three of us will start a scene off a suggestion. And uh, randomly throughout, we're just going to bend down and pick up one of the lines. And that will be the next line that we say. Uh, oh my God. Are we going to keep them in here? No, dump them out. All of them? Okay, it's like a wedding. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Nothing like a wedding. <laughs> you do it right. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, let me get a suggestion. Somebody, the first word that comes out of your mouth. You said like four in your head. Come on. Actually, Hungry. I didn't. Actually <laughs> was the word. Actually. Actually, yeah. Okay. Actually. You are over there. <laughs> Well, if you were to look, really, actually, the answer is set. You were obviously were wrong. <laughs> no, I'm not wrong ever. Okay, so I know, I know that five plus two is eight. I know it. Oh, sweet man. <laughs> Don't touch me. I know math. Listen, when I was in tough situations, my father would always used to tell me, it's so fluffy, I'm going to die. <laughs> And so, uh, those are words that I really took to heart. That's so inspirational, Dad. Anytime I do homework, I just, it's so fluffy. <laughs> so just, that answer is, is rather pointy. You're right. And sharp. It is a pointy answer. Pointy, sharp answer. Seven's the fluffy answer. Not for everything. But for this thing. For this particular one. You make so much sense. Yes. I'm going to draw it as a puff ball. Yes, uh, come in, please. Um. Yeah, hey, how did you do on that math homework? Oh, I got seven. It's the fluffy answer. It's the fluffy <laughs> answer? Yeah. That's not the answer I got at all. Ooh. What I got was this one time at band camp. <laughs> Wait, oh. what happened at band camp? Well, she got the wrong answer. It's she got, you got the wrong answer at band camp? I guess so. Band camp apparently teaches you absolutely nothing well, about math. Well, that's okay, because the other day when I was in class, the teacher told me, to feel the rhythm, to feel the rhyme, to get up on its bobsled. <laughs> That's what teacher said. Teacher told me to, you know, get Children, up on it. Children, please. So, sorry, Mr. Smith, we just kind of... You're very sorry. Here. That's very I, rude. I, know, I, just, I just really wanted to say, Houston, we have a problem. <laughs> <laughs> so everybody just slow down. What? <laughs> I just, I... I really came over here to tell you a really big secret. What is it? Tell us a secret. What's the secret? I'm your worst nightmare. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's really only one thing I have to say to that, and, and that's sorry it took me so long. The traffic was crazy. That's all I've been saying. I'm really sorry. Everybody just calm down. <laughs> I want to tell you something. Tell this us. might calm you down. Okay. Life is like a box of chocolates. <laughs> okay? Now, you can run around and be my worst nightmare, or you can take a break. Uh, you know what, Mr. Smith? They come in pints? <laughs> yes, anger comes in pints, of course. But I just need you to slow down. I just think it's funny, because you're not pint-sized. I just... I just <laughs> Please, stay away from my desk. Don't be calm. 
All fat jokes aside and really horrible math, there's something I need to tell you both. <laughs> Certainly of death, small chance of success. <laughs> what are we waiting for? It makes no sense, Mr. Smith. Oh, I make sense. What are we waiting for? I'm going to box your jaws. Can I have your time? <laughs> I guard my time valuably, but... Yes, you may. Just, just one, just one, just... Here's looking at you, kid. <laughs> you know that I'm looking at you. Okay. A wise prophet once wrote down... Right. Inconceivable! <laughs> We can find a solution to the math problem and to and to her wanting to punch me in the all face. All of the tension <laughs> is off in one way, and that that thing is going to be Luke. I am your father. <laughs> yes. First of all, I'm your teacher. Do not use my first name. I, and second of all, gross. Sorry, I'm, just trying to help. I'm gonna write a letter to your mother, oh. and it will say these words exactly. You start off with a swollen brain and develop a raging fever. You get very angry and irritable and get very big case of the munchies. I will tell her how you do that in class. That's only happened a long time! You are very irritable. Mr. Smith, if you do that, you know what I'm going to tell the principal? We have to go deeper. <laughs> that is exactly what I'm going to tell the principal, and he'll know. Yeah. <laughs> Quite a racket coming from this room, and uh, in my principal's office, I heard a lot of noise. Uh, it was a big problem. Hakuna Matata. Very <laughs> 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 okay. You guys, he's right. He's right. We but should all just calm down and, and think to ourselves, <laughs> stupid fat hobbits, you ruined it. <laughs> <laughs> You don't know where it will take you, but you know where you hope to go. <laughs> 
There's a safe place to hide that we can just listen to and it'll stop all this violence. May the force be with you. Now you're a Jedi for not pretending things. Would you... Shh. My common sense is tingling. <laughs> not again. And this is shaped like a pig. I think... I think your problem is that you were mistreated as a child. And that's why you won't come home with us. This is the day that you almost caught Captain Jack Sparrow! <laughs> Strong enough to carry the ring. <laughs> 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 